to my channel so guys um it's no longer news that um of what is happening to the view so today's video says whoopi can't the view is of the air as host creates partition problems okay problems with viewers hmm. okay so this one is from common sense G uh, garage let's check it out guys and see what it's about Hey there guys, welcome to the channel. So sadly, I have to report something very, very sad. The view is off the air. Really? It's bittersweet. I'm gonna have to dig through the archives to keep picking on our pal Whoopi. But that said, this could possibly be, very well be the best news of the summer, if we're being honest. So basically, I guess what's been going on is there's this writer's guild strike that we're all aware of, most of us are aware of. It hasn't really affected our lives any, thankfully. And this, also didn't seem to affect the view too terribly much, I thought. You know, it really is just a bunch of old limousine, liberal, extreme Marxists sitting around parroting the day's most vitriolic, targeted propaganda. But whoever the machine wants to target today, that's what they did. And while also playing fanboy and apologist for literally anything and everything that the liars, cheats, and alleged criminals in Biden's orbit do or say. So not really necessary, I'd think, to have writers for something like that. But I guess, honestly, I think that the last straw for producers were, and when they realized that this just cannot continue without writers was when Whoopi started talking about getting laid in the pool. An absolutely freaking horrific moment. And I could not unsee it or unhear it. I'm not going to play it for you guys because that is not fair. But anyway, also apparently ratings have been slipping because... When they do have Hollywood related guests on, I guess they're prohibited from talking about any of their projects. Can't talk about anything Hollywood related or writer related, strike related, only books if they have them, and sit around and bitch and moan about Donald Trump or Ron DeSantis, which apparently gets pretty boring even for the mushy brain viewers of The View. And uh, so I guess people have been complaining about that and also complaining that without writers, it appears that these fine, fine ladies, they just argue too much. You know, and I didn't even realize that this was a new thing, them arguing too much. But here's one of the better blow-ups. It was about Miranda Lambert and the crazy stuff that she did to her, those folks in Vegas. VIP. VIP seats? Yeah, I mean, like you know, literally she can front. see what you're doing and she can see that you're ignorant. It's like, it's like being a lounge singer. You know, you go into a bar, somebody's at the piano and nobody's listening. Yeah. You know, that's what it's like or for you her. Give us I'm speech. just saying. Or like, then give me the respect yes. of watching me while I'm doing my thing. Or may, don't come. Maybe I want to play it again. Well, it doesn't mean you what can't What does that mean? It. Maybe I want to, well, I want the, the fit picture and I want the music in the background. Well, and I'm a thing like they're taking I'll relive it. Themselves Turn on the television, girl. Where are you going? Where are you going? I'm leaving y'all. Because <laughs> <laughs> I, I want to take a pic. I'm actually with them on this one, man. You paid to be there. You know, you don't worry about how I watch. You just be glad that I'm here watching. That was a bad look for Miranda Lampert. That was not a cool thing to do. She must have been having a bad day. And that happens. People have bad days. But another great one to witness was the Jason Aldean fiasco. Of course, they had plenty to say about this surprisingly even view fans thought whoopi was out of touch on this one take a look at this but before we do guys thanks to everyone who's been subscribing and uh, leaving great comments we appreciate the support and if you haven't already guys make sure you like comment subscribe most importantly share the channel it really helps us grow and uh, every time you do one of these things the leftist loses their wings take a look there's a lot wrong here with this. This is a man who saw what happens when someone is out of control right. with their guns. Yeah. He's he someone who was, he was performing, was performing in, Vegas, in, Vegas, in Vegas and he was he saw people get so I don't understand how he could be that disconnected, how people around him didn't say to him, hey, listen, you know what? Maybe there's a better way to do this because... Well, the imagery you, invoked I, race. That's yeah. what was... There's it, no it, reason it to separate race. big city people from small town None. people. That, to me, is the divisive part of this song. I mean, it's a deplorable song and it's... Yeah. So we have a break for these fine ladies. Going into the next yeah, season, which is supposed to happen in September. And honestly, I gotta say, moves like this situation right here, they usually... This is usually when shows make a, some kind of change. Change their host you know, get rid of the show altogether. That's just speculation. I have no idea what's going on, but this is when they would do it. Like I said, change hosts, cancel the show even, 
or even likely, you know, ABC has been having very, very serious financial problems. They may even try to find a way to sell the show to a competing network. And uh, anyway, I just wanted to share the bad news with you guys. Wanted you to hear it from me first, uh, that we got to go at least a month without having to listen to the insanity from Whoopi or Joy or uh, Sonny. Let me know uh, your thoughts in the comments, guys, and please don't forget to like. long overdue i didn't even know people were watching the view when i used to watch the view I, none of them were, were the hosts and it's even just not did that even got me to know that oh it, there are a bunch of women that sit around and argue and do what women do but just argue argue raise their voices and you know call out people unnecessarily and now go snow the person <laughs> like jason did that made me even know so i don't even understand like people will just sit and watching a show like that like, i don't understand there's nothing to gain so i think it's high time they went to rest so it's a, it's, it's long overdue they need a rest so uh, and i pray that they, they learn from this when they get to come back and they're fully matured because you know that age does not equal maturity so i just hope that they are they are learning from this and they actually get to hear from the viewers how are you not getting review from viewers you are just there doing like all money like nobody can talk to you you are above the law like i i, I wasn't even thinking that jason has been actually like what's actually suing would have been i think i would have loved it let me know what you guys what, what do you think we would have loved if jason had actually sued but of course what do you think about it like this uh george mr george said that maybe they're trying to like revamp or do something maybe they went off here for not for another reason that we may not be aware of but what do you guys think do you think that actually the show was actually taken off air because of the backlash as has been the show has been getting um who knows maybe the viewers have declined but i would love to hear from you guys let me know what your thoughts are in the comment section guys don't forget to like and subscribe and, and do you be you but do not so do not conform and be happy guys because everything is going to be alright. So don't worry guys. Ciao, ciao.